Hey, my good friends, Sam Haymart with Test Driven TV. Would you have a look at this? The new Lamborghini Revuelto V12 plug-in hybrid, 1000 plus horsepower and a body that is sexy, sexy, sexy. But what I think is most interesting about this car is what's under the skin. In a time with massive change in the automotive landscape is coming from every direction, Lamborghini introduces their first plug-in hybrid supercar, the LB744 Revuelto. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but it sure sounds good. Packing a 6.5 liter naturally aspirated V12 and three electric motors, it boasts over a thousand horsepower and all-wheel drive. Arriving on the 60th anniversary of the mark, Revuelto is built upon a new monocoque platform built primarily of carbon fiber and forged composites, with aluminum used for some body panels and the main rear substructure. Design brings a modern take on the classic Lamborghini DNA of the classic Countach, Diablo, and more recently the Murcielago. A shark nose is bookended with Y-shaped LED signature lighting, deep side air and lets break up the body lines ahead of the rear wheels, and large 20 and 21 inch wheels fill those corners out well. At the rear is a set of hexagonal exhaust outlets up high just behind the fully exposed V12 engine that looks remarkably retro underneath all of the modern angles and materials. Nearly hidden when closed is an active rear wing that changes depending on the drive mode. When open or raised in other positions, it can provide downforce needed at its top speed, which exceeds 217 miles per hour, according to Lamborghini. The powertrain, of course, is a work of art. The all-new L545 6.5 liter V12 naturally aspirated engine sits midship with a unique transverse mounted 8-speed dual-clutch automated manual transmission. The engine itself has 835 horsepower and 534 pound-feet of torque. This is augmented by a 147 horsepower electric motor generator integrated into that transmission. At the front axle, there are two additional electric motors with 295 horsepower together, which give the Revuelto all-wheel drive and a total system 128 horsepower. Weighing in at 3,900 pounds, that gives it a stunning 3.85 to 1 horsepower to pound ratio. And to that, Lamborghini says it will accelerate from 0 to 60 in 2.6 seconds. In driving, the V12 engine powers only the rear wheels, with the electric motor at the rear able to add power when needed. This motor also starts the engine. It's the power generator for the lithium-ion battery, and with the front electric motors, can power the Revuelto on electric power alone. The two motors up front can provide torque vectoring for each front wheel for maximum traction, but also chassis dynamics for cornering. When in electric mode, they can power the Revuelto in front wheel drive only, but the rear electric motor can also step in when needed. The front drive motors also provide regenerative braking power back to the battery. Its 3.8 kilowatt hour lithium ion battery sits in the center tunnel between the two seats. It measures 61 inches long, 12 inches high, and 10 inches wide about the size of a large golf bag. It can be plugged in and charged in about 30 minutes, or it can get its charging the normal way through regenerative braking, and even directly from the V12 engine in as little as six minutes. From behind the wheel, both driver and passenger will enjoy what has become one of the best interiors in the car industry with bespoke materials, colors, and now an array of information interfaces that reset the bar for cockpit technology. The design and the layout are just as visually distinctive as the exterior with lots of little details and exposed carbon fiber here and there. Ahead of the driver is a 12.3 inch digital cockpit and on the passenger side a 9 inch display that keeps your buddy up to speed on what's happening. Topping it off is a new steering wheel design that has added controls for all of the vehicle dynamics and infotainment commands at your fingertips. With over 70 colors to choose from, the cabin is wrapped in a combination of rich leathers and a new ultralight Corsatex fabric in Dynamica microfiber. Now, if you're one of the target customers for this car, you likely already have a handshake with your dealership and know how you're going to get it already and what it might cost when you can get it. If you have to ask, you're probably not a customer for this car. Now, obviously, it's unlikely I'll get a test drive of this car because, well, Lamborghini doesn't have me on speed dial, but I really do I like the car. And if this is what plug-in hybrid is going to look like going forward, 
um, sign me up and I'll take this color while we're at it. I guess I'll just have to sell one of my vacation houses to afford it. That said, um, if you want to see our latest video, that's going to be right there. Better yet, subscribe to our YouTube channel right there because either way, I want you to stay tuned.